Thank you, Charlotte, and good morning, everyone, and, and thank you all so much for coming here today. I also want to take this opportunity to acknowledge uh, former Mayor Art Agnes, as well as former Mayor Willie Lewis Brown, Jr., who will be speaking shortly. This really brings back hard memories um, for myself, and I definitely know for the family of Mayor Ed Lee, who is joining us here today. Over the past year, um, we have um, celebrated so many major accomplishments that Mayor Lee helped to initiate during his time in office. In fact, maybe a week after he passed away, we went and cut the ribbon on the Auburn Hotel, a place for formerly homeless veterans. 70 formerly homeless veterans who now have an affordable place to call home. So many amazing things, including today, where through the small site acquisition program that Mayor Ed Lee helped to start, we will be acquiring a site, an incredible site that is the housing for seniors. And when he served as an attorney for the Asian Law Caucus during his time when he fought for public housing residents, this was one of the sites that he was able to help to secure way back then. And now we are going to be able, through the help of Chinatown Community Development, we're going to be able to purchase the property to protect those tenants, those seniors. I know today, as I said, is, is a really hard day for so many of you who worked side by side with Mayor Ed Lee for so many years, whether it was his time as the director of the Human Rights Commission or his time as purchaser for the city and county of San Francisco or his time as a director of Department of Public Works, his time as city administrator. So many of you have fond memories and have developed incredible relationships with him. And now we are a testament to his legacy, the work that we will continue to do to honor many of the commitments that he has made to the residents of San Francisco. His model on a regular basis, let's get to work. And that's exactly what we are going to continue to do for the people of this city. We're going to continue to work even harder than ever. And let me tell you, I got so many stories about Mayor Ed Lee. We all know he wasn't like Mayor Art Agnes and Mayor Willie Brown and I. We wouldn't let anybody take the credit for our stuff, did we? <laughs> I remember on many occasions, President Cohen and I, we were always in his office, always asking for stuff and say, Mayor, do you mind if we take the credit on this? <laughs> and he would always say, go ahead, no problem. That's the kind of person he was. He didn't want the credit. He just wanted the results. He just wanted San Francisco to be a better place. And I am so, you know, he and I bonded over the fact that we both grew up in public housing. And when I came to him with my desire to change public housing and to just really make sure that people don't have to live in the conditions like I had to grow up in, like he had to grow up in in Seattle, where there was mold and busted pipes and roaches and all the craziness that sadly still exists today. He rolled up his sleeves. We worked with Olson Lee and we fought against a lot of people who opposed the RAD program. And now we have already rehabilitated thousands of units because he wouldn't say no. He said yes to opportunity. He said yes to changing the lives of those people living in those conditions. And I constantly run into some of those people today, most in tears, happy about just the fact that their bathroom has a nice new floor and their towel rack is not falling down some of the things that so many of us take for granted because that's the kind of person that Mayor Edley was. Looking out for each and every one of us, focusing on doing the work, 
fiercely loyal and fiercely committed to serving the people of this great city. And it is really truly an honor to follow in his footsteps and to try and move so many of the projects that he cared so dearly about forward. And I am looking forward to continuing to accomplish those goals with each and every one of you. We owe him that. We owe San Francisco that. And he would be proud if we are able to deliver on that promise. So I want to thank each and every one of you for being here today. And I especially want to thank his family. I want to thank Anita and Tanya and Brianna, who are constantly on the front lines. Every time they're invited to something, they are there every time to make sure that they knew Mayor Lee would be there if he could. And they know that they are in need, they're needed to be there in his place. And I know his spirit is with us here today.